Hey, my sea bubbas and mature doll collectors out there, doll lovers, beautiful doll people, and baddies. Um, welcome back to my channel. It's Bubble Tea here, and y'all. <laughs> Now that that Thanksgiving turkey is like done with, okay, thank goodness. I mean, I'm not really a Thanksgiving person, but Christmas, 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 Christmas. <laughs> Let's just say Christmas is about to be lit. And y'all, we already have a doll Christmas tree. It is literally perfect. I was scared it wasn't going to be tall enough, but look at these lights. <laughs> yes, okay. Enough said about that. I'm definitely going to be doing a ton of like holiday Christmas videos, so no worry. But today, this video is actually going to be about our dolly fashions, okay? So, if you guys have not seen me unbox the Barbie Dream Closet, I'm literally obsessed with it. I haven't done a customization of it yet. But anytime you see this doll closet pop up, which is now our fashion studio, whatever, but. <laughs> That just means we're going to be trying on some doll fashions like Barbie all the way. Barbie's in the house. OK, um, so that, if you were wondering, OK, why does this doll closet keep popping up? That is exactly why, because that's where we're going to put our clothes once we try them on. You know what I mean? So it makes complete sense. Also, we have some core girls here that you've probably seen before. But before I get into that, I'm actually going to put a little description below telling you guys, whoever is watching this video, if you actually just want to see me unboxing the clothes and trying it on the dolls, then you can skip through all of this stuff of me talking because I am going to talk a little bit about the doll series, where those are. I'm going to be introducing you guys to some of these characters and telling you a little bit about them. So for all of you that, you know, have been on this channel for a minute and know that I'm writing all these doll series for you guys intensively, okay, um, then, you know, stay with me with that. So with that being said, let's continue. So if you guys don't already know some of our little characters here, um, I say core characters because that's basically what they're going to be. So like in the doll series that I'm writing, that's mainly going to be Barbies featuring Barbies. Um, that series is is going to be featuring none other than Liana right here. Look at her. She's so beautiful. Gorgeous doll. Danny. Her real name is Daniela, but you know, you know how it goes. Uh, <laughs> she's our tall girl. Look at her. Look at her. I mean, she's holding... I just love her so much. Anywho. <laughs> and then we have Sonya here. If you haven't watched my unboxing of the Super Mario pack, her and her sister Sade were featured in that video. So she's used to, you know, trying on these clothes. We have... <laughs> okay, I don't know why I'm laughing, but <laughs> we have Ami back there. I don't know what she's doing, but Ami is... I mean, she's such a gag to me. Like, she's so, she's just so many things. You'll see, guys. And then we have another character that I'm slowly, like, integrating into the series right now. And her official name is going to be Nazneen, okay? And, y'all, this doll is so beautiful. If you haven't seen my unboxing of her with some other fashionista dolls that I like, look at this doll okay and i i definitely was looking for some clothes that would complement her body shape because she does have a different body shape than the rest of our dolls here and that is the reason why she isn't articulated just yet because i really want to keep her body shape for that diversity because everybody's body isn't the same okay but i don't want to switch her to a made to move body because we're going to lose that. We're going to lose that extra oomph. You know what I mean? And I know people are going to say, oh my God, but bubble tea, like that's stupid. You know, why just make it easier on yourself? You know what I mean? Instead of trying to find all these different clothes for all these different body types. Y'all, this is what I do. Okay. <laughs> if you don't know already, I have a degree in costume design and like, this is what we do. You know what I mean? We, we try to get looks that fit people to the T, you know what I mean? So we had to pay attention to stuff like that. And yeah, I'm just used to it. So <laughs> I have no problem with doing it. Also guys, for the doll series, I will let you know, a lot of people might be confused. Um, I know a couple of people were asking me questions like, wait, are you still doing the Brad series? And yes, so the whole reason why 
it's going to take a little while for any of these series to start up is because I'm writing them all at the same time because they actually are all taking place in the same world. Mm -hmm. So there has to be some sort of continuity going on there because some of the stories are going to overlap. So yeah, I'm just planning out how that's actually going to happen and who's going to be overlapping. You see what I mean? So I mean, as you know, Barbies are living in their Barbie world. You know what I mean? They're living in this mainland. You have brats that are sort of living in their communities. All these dolls, they have their own communities. OMGs, they have their own thing going on. And their separate series are just kind of focusing on those individual dolls. But then you're going to have crossover moments. You're going to have moments where they go to a place that's populated with all different types of dolls. So yeah, y'all, this, <laughs> this, I know it sounds like a lot, but I mean, one day at a time. Okay. And let's be honest, you got to be patient for really good stuff. So I'm not even rushing it at all. I'm taking my time with it. And while I'm doing that, I have time to collect these dolls, still do what I love doing as a doll collector and doing stuff extra, like crazy stuff on my channel. So like, yeah, y'all. <laughs> and also stay tuned, guys, because soon I am going to be doing a tutorial on how to pierce your doll's ears and give them nose piercings and things like that. So, <laughs> yeah, just stay tuned for that. OK, with that aside, let's get into the clothing. haul. So first off, guys, we have Liana rocking this. <laughs> She honestly looks like she's just wearing a trash bag. Like, I'm not even, I'm not even gonna joke with you guys, but like, <laughs> and you know, I keep it honest, especially with these Barbie bags. <laughs> she literally looks like she's wearing a freaking trash bag, okay? But Liana's the type of person, if you don't already know, that is okay with wearing a trash bag and she makes it look good, honey, okay? She loves the sparkle. She's all about standing out the way she dresses y'all she she pretty much looks good in everything it's it's crazy she's one of those people you know this thing has a ton of sparkles on it like look at the way my lights are freaking out on it <laughs> she also has this really adorable little clear purse you already know how she feels about her clear accessories very cute i don't have this mold yet so i'm very happy about that and then we have our little reindeer. Oh, it's almost like an ugly Christmas dress. <laughs> I didn't want to say it, but you know, <laughs> I had somebody had to say it. Uh, and then she's also has like a pink strip in the back. Hmm, very interesting. I kind of wish it was all this little uh, sparkly silver color, but I mean, a as long as the the front says "Oh, look at me," then I think it's okay for her. So now we have Danny wearing this really cute, y'all, this, I think this one is my favorite out of all the little holiday packs they came out with. This one has to be my favorite. I mean, we always need like, you know, sleepwear. We always need some sleepwear. So this thing, look at it. It has little gingerbread men on it, Christmas trees, hearts, candy canes. It's just really cute. And I love that it's short sleeves. And it comes with the shorts and even the shirt has a collar on it. I mean, all they needed to do was give it some faux buttons. Okay, dang, Mattel. Like you give us some really great stuff, but they never push it to the next level. You know what I mean? Like, <sighs> anywho, <laughs> this thing also came with a little doggy. Look at that little dog. So freaking adorable. He is sleeping. Let's have her hold him. <laughs> uh oh, never mind. Okay, I'm sorry, but Danny holding this little tiny freaking dog is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Like, what? Danny is kind of like a hardcore bitch, and her holding this dog <laughs> is, is giving me so much peace right now <laughs> in this in this horrible world. Okay, y'all, let's go to the next fashion pack. Next up, we have Sonia, who's wearing this really cute skirt and shirt Christmas combination here. I love how this looks knitted, but it isn't actually knitted. I think the pattern actually does really well, you know what I mean? If it wasn't it, that would have been great. But I do like how it's finished at the edges. It's not like any raw edges, even on the shirt. All the edges are finished. We have a serge top up here. 
really nice i mean nice quality i think overall this one is a really good set to have this is merry and bright on it i mean <laughs> you can't go wrong okay it is like a little plain white t-shirt so it can practically go with anything as long as it's christmas time i guess uh, <laughs> and then also the set came with this little barbie christmas box so i don't know is sonia friends with barbie or I don't know, but it's an empty Christmas box, which I love, and it's perfect size for her to be giving that to somebody as a gift. Clearly, it has to be a gift for Barbie, I guess, but <laughs> I guess we'll have to figure that out. But I do love this little set. It's adorable. Also, another thing, sometimes I do love when sets don't just come with, you know, accessories per se, like that you can wear, but accessories that you can just have on you, like the cute little dog or this little Christmas box, so... Next up, we have Ami, and oh my god, look at, okay, <laughs> I love Ami, if y'all, if you can't tell, I mean, I love all my dolls, but Ami has a special place in my heart, okay, <laughs> she is rocking this outfit, okay, first off, it's definitely her style, because she likes to wear a lot of, like, plain, soft-colored clothes, yeah, most of her clothes are plain, let's be honest, but they're very cute, you know what I mean? Like, the silhouette is always very cute on her. So, this fits her perfect. The skirt, okay, first off, it's like jean, you know what I mean? But the color, the color of blue is so pretty. It's almost like gray, let's be honest. I think this skirt is so cute. The way it comes off, like, whoo, honey, it's making that waist look snatched let's just say that okay i mean ami isn't about all that you know looking sexy or whatever but honey looks fine on this okay she's definitely gonna be wearing this skirt every day uh she also has a cute little fringed white bag let's take that off so we can get a closer look at that we have our white french bag here with the little at the top it doesn't actually open you already know but <laughs> it looks very cute as a whole and then to top it off the shirt slash hoodie with no sleeves okay first off very cute i love that it's cropped Ugh, okay all finished edges look at the hoodie part it looks so freaking cute on her let it freaking snow honey all day long i love it look at the cute little snowman ah okay this is so adorable I absolutely love it so far i'm really enjoying this christmas packs yeah guys i don't know about you but she'll probably go out and get some okay <laughs> so lastly guys i have here a really big fashion pack um it it, it isn't like a, a part of the Christmas line or anything like that, but it definitely gave me some winter vibes, you know what I mean? So I thought several of these pieces could be mixed and matched with like clothes we already have or the fashion packs we just opened to create more looks for our girls. So let's take a look at each item in this pack. First up, guys, we have Nazanin rocking this gorgeous gorgeous freaking dress i love this thing i'm obsessed with this thing and period that's what it is i really want to see how this thing looks with a long sleeve white shirt which i'm gonna have to try on one of these days but right now she's wearing a black leather dress leather long sleeve okay underneath this thing to complement the dress and she is topping it off all with a red if she was wearing this any other time of the year, I would be okay with it. This is definitely a fall look. It just, it looks so cute on her also, by the way. Like, y'all, let me know in the comments what you think about this look because I think it's so gorgeous on her. Next up, we have Ami back again, y'all. One of her favorite colors, actually her favorite color, period, is purple, y'all. So I had to give the little purple shirt with the frilly sleeves, I mean, She's all about the frilly sleeve. Like, check this out, honey. Yes, this is like literally her favorite dress. First off, the shirt is so cute. It fits her perfectly. It's crazy. And she's also rocking this really cute pearlescent purse. Ooh, let's get a close up of that. Here's a close up of just the detail on the purse, which I really like. In the chain there very cute very cute little accessory i love it 
Okay, now we have Liana wearing this so cute, okay, pencil skirt that is pleated at the top. Like, yes, Mattel, this is what we want. This is what we need. We don't need any of that other crap, okay? Like, this looks so cute. The pattern looks adorable. Look how amazing it looks on her. First off, okay, matches her lipstick. One of her favorite colors is red. Her other favorite color is blue, by the way. But, man, is she not going to be wearing this, okay, to the office holiday party, you know what I mean? <laughs> sip, sip, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Lastly, guys, we have Danny giving us another pajama option. You know, sometimes your pajamas aren't actually matching. You feel me? You just throw on a random t-shirt, random shorts, and call it a day. But I love these two together because they definitely both give off that wintry holiday vibe. And the shirt is definitely on point with Danny because she also really loves animals. Like, yeah, she's that type of person. <laughs> and look at the polar bear. He looks so adorable. Guys, thank you so much for tuning into this video. If you guys aren't already subscribed, once again, don't be afraid to subscribe. And guys, comment down below which one of these fashion packs is your favorite, whether you're going to go out and buy these for this holiday. Y'all, just talk to me now. <laughs> don't be scared to talk because... I definitely love responding to you guys. So thank you so much. I hope you guys stay beautiful, stay collecting, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.